Hey, it's Chris with Shopping Cart Apps. In this session, we're creating a conversion goal in Microsoft Ads to work with your Shopify store. There are many types of conversion goals you may want to track, but we're going to focus on the most important one, purchases on your website. Now let's get started. Log into Microsoft Ads. Select Tools. Select Conversion Goals. Select Create a Conversion Goal. Now name your conversion goal. You can leave the default type to destination URL. Select next. For destination URL, select contains. Enter thank underscore you. For goal category, select purchase. For scope, leave the default to only the Microsoft account you are in. For revenue value, select conversion action may vary, then enter zero for conversions that have no value. Make sure to select the default currency as well. It is best to select the default currency that matches your Microsoft account, and hopefully that is also the primary currency of your store. This keeps the performance metrics in Microsoft ads in the same currency to make for easier management of campaigns. For count, Leave the default to all, as you'll want to track as many conversions that come from the same person in the same conversion window. Speaking of which, for conversion windows, I suggest the default stay at 30 days. As most advertising platforms use this time frame, and it will make it easier to compare Microsoft advertising performance to your other ad platforms. The same goes for leaving the default view through conversion to one day. For including conversions, make sure this is selected so the purchase type conversions are counted as a conversion in Microsoft Ads. Finally, select the UET tag that you placed or plan to place on your store and select Save. Now, to complete the conversion and revenue tracking, you'll have to add the proper code to your site, which we'll cover in another session. That's all for now. Until next time, keep it simple, keep it fun, and keep at it.